back for the DIY video bottle of sweat, am I even saying? We're back for the next video. It's our DIY glass bottle, part two and the final part. Um, so we have our bottle here. I finished doing the paint. And then I have the rest of the supplies for it. So you're going to need some sand, as I have in this shot glass and this big ice cream jug. You're going to need the food coloring, some food coloring, I use the food coloring of these colors, um, some shot glasses, some plastic bowls, um, a homemade funnel, which is really easy to make. You just take a water bottle, cut it, open the lid, and it works as a funnel. A spoon, and obviously this part of the project. So we're going to start by taking this little shot glass that I have pre-filled with sand and take this pink food coloring, and we're going to put about three drops in. Um, three drops should be enough, uh, but just keep in mind that depending on what um, color you're using and how much you have, it will vary. So then we're just going to stir this like it was food. And so I'm just going to stir this for a minute, and when I get it stirred up, I'll be back. Okay, so I put it into a bowl and I'm mixing it, and I got way too much sand on this one, so it's taking a while to mix, um, but I'm working on it, so, um, but yeah, so it's pretty basic to make. I've already done all the other colors. I did blue, green, yellow, and purple, which are the colors in our bottle, and I've mixed those because this is my third try trying to get this video to work, and it hasn't, so that's been kind of an issue, and I still don't think I have enough food coloring. Maybe I do. I don't know. We'll see. So I'll check back in soon. Alrighty, so I got it mixed just about good enough. I might mix it a little more here and there, but I'm going to take the funnel that my brother made. I'm going to pour this in. Just, hope, just know that you might want to vacuum or do this not in your office chair in your bedroom with carp because it is a mess. So I poured it in my funnel and I'm just going to let it sip out. I got a lot of sand in this. So now we have our colors made and so we get to do the fun part now. Okay, so I have my bottle and my funnel. So I'm going to start by taking my blue and I'm just going to start pouring the sand. And not all of it. You, not all of it at first. You want to do a little bit of, at a time. About that much full. And you're going to do that with all the colors and you're just going to keep doing it. And you might have to mix more together. And so I'll be back when I've got this thing full. So I've got the first layer done. I don't know how you can see it, but I got the first layer done. Make sure you do not shake it. Do not shake it. The sands will mix it. It will not look as cold. All right, be back soon. It's done. So I just finished adding my sand. And as you can see what it looks like in the bottle, it's just layers of color. Like I said, do not shake. It looks really awesome. And then my lid is tucked back here. So I'll screw it on, and I might have gotten a little too much, but I don't think I did. I don't know. I'll put it on straight later. And this is how you make a DIY glass bottle um, with some sand in it. And it's super cool. It's easy to do if you've seen the steps. So go try it at home. Like and subscribe this video. And have a great time making one of these guys. They make super cute decorations. See ya.